All right, push day. Just finished my 50 burpees. Felt really good doing them once I warmed up. Got a little sweat going. I got the long bar. I've got the yellow band. We're still doing 15 reps. Let's get them going. Fantastic. What I used to do, well, I used to, when I was doing the yellow band, what, two months ago, before I started this 15 rep program, I was getting to 12 and I was only, I was starting to fatigue. This way I went all the way into 15 and fatigued heavily on the 15th. So, making progress. got the x-ray dark gray band crossovers Hidden failure on that left chest, but feeling stronger. I got farther before I failed, so progress. bar serious steel blue band because we did upright rows on Sunday we're doing overhead press today 
for the second workout. total and you can see the breaks that I'm having in between none Triceps are next. And I've got the Serious Steel 37 inch band. Same as the uh, X3 Dark Gray band, but it's a few inches shorter, so it's gonna be a little bit tighter towards the chest. So we'll see how I do with this. Oh, yeah. Try to get in there, try to slip off my back. I'm kind of sweaty in the back. Whew. Oh, yeah, you can see how nice and tight this is. Much more stimulation, bringing that tension all the way up to here, almost a full collapse position. And that right out, since it's the green band, it's obviously not as strong as the black band, but it has some great tension all the way out. Tricep burn.
Thank you to um, Epidemic Music for playing the background music. It's um, Epidemic Funk, this particular channel, which is all funk music, which I like funk, funk's cool. I like rock, I like country, I like jazz, I like everything. But when I'm working out, I like heavy metal, I like funk, and I like some upbeat country. So, what we're going with today. All right. We got chaos. I went with the, uh, I went with the, uh, Serious Steel Black Band this time. Put it up on my shoulders. We're gonna hold on to that bar back there. We're gonna do the tricep, or the calves. You know what I'm doing. Thirty with that. Thirty. Had to reset it up because I was a little too far away from the bar. Had to lean it out too much, so I want to get closer. Turn that sound music now, so I can hear myself think. That's it for today. I have no doubt doing these burpees and doing these kettlebell swings every other day will help me get rid of this, really help me activate my core a lot. Especially the burpees, going down and getting in a plank position, push up, really extenuating that plank position into a hollow body before I kick up into the standing position. I can really feel my abs getting a lot more work, which is fantastic. Burning more calories, feeling more eject, feeling more nimble doing this, running on. My toes for the uh, in between, drop it down. Obviously, getting the hinge movement, getting the flexibility, feeling better. Obviously, as I was going more, I was getting warmer. My body was getting warmed up. I was feeling better as I was doing them. Fantastic. Walked right into the X3 push program, which I love doing. Fantastic. Still sticking with that 15 or so reps right now, trying to burn out that and doing them one after another after another. As you can see, there's no rest. Boom, we're done. Less than 15 minutes. I want to finish this off before it hits 15. Thanks for all for being here. New subscribers, old subscribers, you want to show up every day and do something, you will see results. Working on the diet, getting the diet under control. Got to stop my snacking at night when I'm watching TV. That's the hardest part. You start making me some jerky and snack on jerky instead of uh, sunflower seeds and walnuts and other things. I tend to eat too much of that stuff when I'm snacking. So I need to work on that. So other than that, it was a great day. I got it done. I'm going to live my life, you too, and I'll see you back here tomorrow for kettlebells and pulls.